All right, guys, let's see if Cosmos can redeem themselves, but this time it's going to be against Herald of Perfection. No, 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 no. It's King Prepare. All right, guys, it looks like I roll a seven and he rolls an eight. And I think that he opts to go first. Yes, he does opt to go first. He opens up with that terraforming, searches for that Cosmo Town. I'm going to work on that glare, by the way. I'm not sure why there's more of a glare in this video than the last video. I think it's because we, I think I had more lights on, maybe. I don't really remember um, uh, because I think we recorded this at night if I recall, but either way, I'm going to work on that glare, so there'll be, there should be less glare in the next dual video, but I, I just paid the 3,000 off of Gale Dogra. I'm not going to pay the full 6,000 since he's got a farm grow up. Um, I searched that Dawn of Herald, or yeah, Dawn of Herald, and I'm probably going to activate that Dawn of Herald, and yep, so there's the Dawn of Herald, um, pitch Ben 10, um, have a Herald down, Ben 10 effect, searches a stick, and then, you know, the uh, Dawn of Herald will banish itself, bringing the Ben 10 back to my hand, and yeah, I'm just going to leave that in defense mode. Um, I don't want him, I don't want that herald in attack mode like if he taps out into something obviously and it sucks i, I mean i have that gale dog where like wide open but i needed i needed to have it like <laughs> so i'm gonna eat some damage here and but i mean i just i had to do it i really had to do it um i guess i would have um, less damage if i was playing a manju but gale dog getting you you know two searches even i mean paying six thousand is whatever but he activated that dark hole um it looks like i pitched the benton yeah i ended up uh, pitching that benton so i'm down to uh, some looks like two cards in hand running out of negates running low on negates here um let's see what he does so he uh, um summons tin can activates tin can's effect but he chains the tap out ability of tin can to bring out that forerunner so it looks like we are at a stalemate because i have a 28 booty on the board and he's got that uh 28 uh forerunner on the board so i'm looking at my grave uh, looks like uh, I have two ritual sanctuaries in head. This hand, this is not looking good. This is not looking good. So um, I pitch the uh, ritual sanctuary off a ritual sanctuary, and I search a herald. So I just wanted to have a variant hand to try to hold off until I top decked. I don't even know what I could have top decked. Like not even a brilliant fusion would have saved me. Really, I mean nothing really would have saved me. So I'm not sure what I'm trying to top deck here. But so we are just kind of at a stalemate, which kind of sucks. It makes for a boring game, but it, it doesn't last long, guys. It does not last long. So he gets out tin can all right so he gets out tin can pays that 500 off tin can um i would go to negate but he chains and gets out straw man and um let's see what i do and what did i draw into i probably just end up passing there's probably nothing i can really do i mean unless that's a spell yep yeah. oh it is oh it is a spell but it's a prep so all i do is activate prep of riots get out another herald you know to my hand and uh, that's about all i can do i'm really just trying to hold off until i can you know get some sort of top deck so yeah um obviously cause Cosmos don't have the worst Herald matchup. They can just, you know, chain, you know, chain their uh, tap out abilities, so, which is really, really good. Um, it's not terrible at all. So that's another tin can. Yeah, sorry about that glare again. Another tin can. Uh, slip Rider pops the Ritual Sanctuary. So he gave me the slip. Oh, oh, the puns. He gave me the slip. <laughs> and um, I have, you know, I'm just sitting on that Herald. There's nothing I can really do. And uh, let's see what he does on his turn. Uh, so yeah, there's um, another tin can. Yet yeah, another tin can, guys. Yet yeah, another tin can. Um, he's gonna go to end phase. He's gonna reveal three. So uh, he re reveals a Cosmojo. Um, he reveals the uh, Dark Witch and a Dank Destroyer. And I hit the Witch. Not looking good, guys. Not looking good. And he goes standby phase. Uh, gets out the uh, Dark Lady, Dark Witch, whatever, <laughs> whatever it is. Dark Lady. I can't. No, Dark Witch. Whatever. Whatever she is. She's the one. The Wicked Witch. Uh, no, the Wicked Witch was the other one. So yeah, she negates. So, so that's what she does is negate an effect. I just have a guard at set and yeah so brick city like i mean i did not open up the best he played around all of my negations like a boss and now we are in round two so uh, obviously i go first because <laughs> this is a herald deck i need to go first um i asked a six, all six thousand damage went into like all six thousand uh, went through so i got two searches um i went i go into a herald pitching bin 10 uh search uh, wings off of the bin 10 uh do the uh, uh, looks like i pitch bear set uh set vendor activate vendor probably going to pitch the wings off of the vendor uh this is probably yeah that's what's going down a nil garnet which is not good not looking good so i hope i do not draw a brilliant fusion that would be terrible and um i, I do uh, resolve and get uh, resolve everything uh, properly um i get a search for bear at the end i didn't draw into a bear off of the vendor so that's really good so i got the vendor search at the end I have a lot of negates in hand it looks like um looking really good for me um activate ritual sanctuary uh pitch spell get a search for another herald and um it looks like i just passed turn yep so uh, he activates cosmo town i tried to end with as many negates in my hand as possible ended up with bear and you know all that stuff so uh, uh i'm gonna 
gonna try to uh, negate I mean everything he can throw at me like anything he could possibly throw at me so yep yeah, and then I uh, looks like I what did I do there so he uh, he uh, did he Cosmo Town yeah he Cosmo Towned and paid and added the uh, 10, 10 game back to his hand he attempted to activate the uh, emergency teleport I can't be having that I can't be having him get out a farm girl that would suck and um, I'm just I'm just gonna roll <laughs> roll with this get out another herald this one in attack position I'm going on the attack here um, get out uh, search a stick so uh, activate stick search a chair so it's just another search um, I'm probably gonna flip that uh, herald to attack position uh, let's see because it's not gonna be game even with the Gale Dagra so I probably flip yeah the, the, that's what I usually do if it's not game I flip that Dagra to defense and then I swing with 18 three times so that is pretty good and that's two heralds on board I don't think that he has anything that can really attack over a herald yeah yeah he does he's got um, yeah wicked witch so he does have something he could top deck to get around the herald but I'm kind of banking on him not having it or in like uh, he might have you know he might be able to Cosmo town and shuffle in and try to get it but I was just banking on him not having it I'm just trying to be as aggressive as possible and it paid off it paid off so game three guys game three last game we go the distance we go the distance <laughs> no two O's no two O's so he activates Cosmo town he keeps getting that Cosmo town huh I mean I guess I don't know how many terraformings he, he runs he might be running three terraformings for all I know I mean, I mean honestly I did just see a skill drain in his deck though that's 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 nasty if he opens up that skill drain looks like it's at the, at the bottom of his deck though um but he's about to shuffle so it may, it may it may end up at the top we don't know we don't know that skill drain is just dirty though if he sees it in cosmos it's really really good and he does have the wicked witch out now i see i it's once again uh guys i, I apologize for the glare i will try to fix that glare so um he gets out he gets the slip rider okay so he gets the slip he pops his own cosmo town and he's gonna search for uh, the oh the dark lady again. So he's got he's got her. So um, I'm gonna have to. Uh, he's got oh and he's got a pilot on the field too. So I'm gonna have to play around that. Um, uh, so I normal summon stick. You know stick chair draw search and then he cuts and I draw again off the second chair. Um, really really good. I mean stick and chair are just phenomenal. If you see both of them, if you guys remember what those do back when you know Shadals played them and like I mean every deck really <laughs> had to play them. So uh, overlay three and um, I'm, I think I'm thinking about going in to that Ouroboros so let's see what I do yeah I think I go into the Ouroboros and I'm going to use sticks effect on summon to pop something definitely so because if you guys remember your overlay of stick yeah you get to pop something so I uh, pop my own vendor get a search for wings uh, which means I probably have um, Baron hand or something um, uh, so I, I attempt I, I'm baiting out yeah I'm ba baiting out his pilot I baited out his pilot successfully um, I pitch uh, pitch wings um, and so basically what he what he does is he is uh, he's waiting for, for me to activate wings so he can negate with lady but he did not expect me to get Harold he thought I was still trying to dig for the Harold but I had two Harolds in hand and a dawn I was trying to actually dig for a bin 10 that's what I was trying to dig for but once that lady came out I needed to make Harold so I can successfully uh, you know do the uh, wings play and then see more cards in my hand so uh, that's what he was waiting on that's why he didn't really negate anything because uh, he could have um, you know <clears throat> negated uh, I guess he could have brought out before I summoned uh, Ouroboros and negated Ouroboros but I mean it basically the same thing would have happened either way because I would have just got out Harold and uh, negate I mean because it does a monster effects you know the lady does monster effects so I just would have got out Harold and would have been able to protect my stuff either way it really doesn't matter um, so uh, he, but like I said he was just banking on me not having the Harold he was thinking I was trying to dig for the Herald uh, based on how I was playing I think uh, I think that's how what he thought <laughs> anyway anyways so a uh, dark hole of course I'm gonna negate that dark hole pitching bear he sets a card so I have him on the ropes guys I have him on the ropes uh, I have a pretty solid looking hand lots of fairies looks like lots of fairies and um, let's see what I do here so uh, oh I'm gonna get more fairies so <laughs> so uh, pitch to uh, pay 3,000 um, uh, pay oh I think oh I paid these 6,000 pay the full six 6,000 ballsy very ballsy and get out uh, to get two negates um, I'm, I'm keeping them I guess I'm just gonna keep the pressure on um, I pitched to hit the only card out of his hand using Ouroboros this other effect Ouroboros is kind of like the get that keeps on giving guys like <laughs> if you leave him on the field he's just gonna keep getting effects he's really really good so he's got no cards in hand I'm feeling very confident you know he's got no cards in hand um, I, I have enough fairies in hand to stop you know his stuff from from floating so um, pitch yeah I can stop his stuff from floating um, yep and then kill his stuff uh, <laughs> there was no damage that was a set um, uh, ash blossom so the 18 canceled out had to kill it with the Ouroboros he sets one card and he has nothing he I knew it was gonna be that, that set card was gonna be a Cosmojo or like a bluff uh, you know some sort of bluff terraforming or 
just something. So yeah, guys, that was it. Uh, Cosmos did not redeem themselves. They did not redeem themselves. Um, I don't know what his build is, but I did see a Landwalker. So he's playing something very unorthodox, I think. But I did see the skill drain. Skill drain is very, very powerful. Um, I did see Cosmojo's in there. He, uh, I did. We did see uh, Ash Blossom both games. So he is playing uh, some hand traps as well. Looks like he's just not seeing what he needs. Cosmos. I mean, Cosmos really need you know the, those two um, extra you know Dark Destroyers back. They really need that three emergency teleport back as well because that's just I mean sad. But that is going to do it for this video, guys. Go ahead and let me know what matchup you would like to see next down in the comment section. And if we have the decks or can build the decks, we will try to play them. Or I could try to hunt someone down at locals and get them to play the decks. Just be sure to dick slap that like button and subscribe. Subscribe. <laughs>